This was my first wiring job back in 1994. And it's the first time I ever did a, a whole house. Here's the main breaker box. You can see the work I did in there. And you can see the wires that I have. Now I didn't drill out any of the, the, the um, joists. And you see I ran the wires underneath here. And the guy, the uh, inspector, he wanted me to run um, wood just like I did here all the way across, all the way through here. Well, I never got around to it, and he never showed up. But you can see in the amount of wire that I ran, I would have to have drilled a lot of holes. So, despite everything I ran, I ran it on the joists, or on the main beams. And here you can see more on the main beams. And the one thing... I was able to do was keep everything nice and organized without running it through the, the joints. You can see I have quite a quite a many lines going up through the old network there. But this thing like I said 1994 is when I did this. And I really wasn't into drilling holes and all the all the joints. This is how I did it. Whether it's right or wrong, or it didn't come out uh, pretty nice and clean. I kind of like it better than uh, drilling the living crap out of the joists, which would have been alright too, but uh, they look so nice without like someone going in and turning them out. Now, this was the whole entire house, the whole entire house that I rewired. It wasn't just like a basement and a little here and a little there. Every single wire I replaced in this whole home. There isn't a single piece of, of old wire here. So this was a complete rewire. Well, on the light switches, I did one switch for the light, one for the fan. So when you turn on the one switch, the fan comes on, the other one, the lights come on. That's how I'm wearing that up. So each room has two switches. And as far as the plugs go, I got them, yeah, not every six foot, but I got a good amount of plugs in here. So we have plenty of plugs in the walls. And usually where there's a plug here, I usually ran a plug to the second floor. That's usually uh, a good way to do it. But all wires go to the basement. I don't go into one plug and jump from that plug to the second uh, anywhere, but this was two units. So each wire goes from uh, the plug to the basement. Now here we are on the third floor, and up here I ran a something bus, which I, I don't know why. I guess I thought someone up here would have big plans. And um, they might need like some <laughs> main electric 100 amp something panel. I also wired in three panel pins up here. Because this is like a big room. And when I redid all this, uh, there wasn't any more pull table. It was just a huge room with three panel pins wide open. Uh, pretty nice. So I, put, I put in three switches because I thought, well, maybe someday the little wire um, each fan on one switch. So each one has their own, but right now they only work by one switch. So that's it. That's my first wiring job, and that was back in 1994. This is my first wire, so I think I did pretty good, considering this was my first rewire of a home. I've done like little projects before this, but this was my first one. This box looks the same as that one. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed looking at what I, uh, at what I did back in 1994.